from the company that went bankrupt in the 90s and sold off the rights to its most popular characters comes a film based on the equivalent of leftover scrap metal, proving that Marvel can build a franchise around just about anybody, except the Hulk, Iron Man. Experience the massive success that Marvel turned into a formula for printing money where you take a half-forgotten B-list superhero, cast an unknown or half-forgotten B-list actor, have him fight a generic villain that will only last one movie, fall in love with a generically strong female character, make a ton of quips, talk a bunch of science, destroy some public property, cram Stan Lee in there somewhere, have a blue beam shoot up in the sky, set up an Avengers movie, and force the audience to sit through 500 visual effects guys' names just to catch a few extra seconds. I'm here to talk to you about the Avenger initiative. Hey, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Mr. Stark, you become part of a bigger universe. You grew up loving Batman, Spider-Man, and Superman. Now, get ready for a hero that makes them look like huge nerds by comparison. And meet Tony Stark, a hard partying, Robert Downey Jr.-ish weapons designer, who's the perfect match between actor and role that allowed him to spend the next seven years making a fortune by pretending to look at a screen, pretending to play with some holograms, doing a little voiceover, Keep going. and basically act like himself until someone says cut. Nice work if you can get it. Cheer for a hero whose power is his intelligence, not some magical hammer, as Tony craps out new technology the way you and I crap out breakfast, like this weapon that's used against him, these weapons that are used against him, I think you got a lot of my weapons. this weapon that's used against him, you remember this one, right? This weapon that's used against him. Tony Stark was able to build this in a cave! This miracle technology that becomes a weapon that's used against him. And of course, Ultron. Seriously, Tony, just do the world of solid and stop working. Time to rid the world of weapons! You gave it its best one ever! So revisit the Marvel masterpiece that started it all, without which there would be no Marvel Cinematic Universe. No Avengers, no Guardians, no Winter Soldier leaving Hollywood in the terrifying position of having to develop something original. Ugh. Starring Bruce Wayne, Miss Money Pepper, Obadiah Vane, Terrence How Hard Could It Have Been to Take a Pay Cut for the Sequels, Obligatory Stanio, and The Iron Giant, Marvel Man. Where is it? Wow, that's gotta be the only time someone has ever looked cool riding a Segway. Be sure to subscribe for more Honest Trailers.